get my piece. Push a peak. Cop no hammers for my peak. We don't want no peace. Got a spot of puff rack. Jake for peace. Drop the dad and now we plant. Inside the peace. She not a lesbian for peace. She turned lesbian. Push a peak. Push a peak. On capital P, I write the president. Cop president. She let me squeeze, then she leave, cause she keep the pee. Private speak, private seat, bitch, I'm pushing pee. Purple paint, pussy paint, bitch, I'm pushing pee. Push a pee, 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 push a pee. Yes, yes, and I'm back. Time lapsed off about three minutes, so hope y'all like that. Now I'm gonna talk. I gotta call tech support. I should go ahead and jump on that right now, but I'm trying to get a lot of stuff done. I can really wait to call tech support for the gauges till I'm ready to put the dash in. So today we should have some sound in this boy. Um, explaining y'all the system. We got two seats in the halves and the kick panels, which is two right there. Four in the front of the console, one on each side, and a tweeter two in the back one on each side then the back deck we got uh two on each side and a tweeter too so and then we got tweeters in the dash fab the mounts and all that for that but uh the whole trunk man i was not supposed to do the trunk but the trunk was so fucking bad like there was no way that i could just let it go and then i'm the last one that touched it so i was like nah i'm gonna just go ahead and do it it costs me, but still, it's better for me to do it than to not do it. And then now, uh, hey, Steve, the last point that touched that damn car, that trunk looked crazy as hell. You seen it? I already know how it go. So I just went on here. I took my loss on that one, but he paid for uh, the wire. Uh, he paid for all the materials except the wood for the battery box and the uh, amp rack. I just threw it in there, man, because I just couldn't let it go like that. So... All that's getting redone, as y'all can see. Uh, I was waiting on wire, which is here now. So I gotta do another power, fuse power wire, run that to my power setup, and then uh, one grand wire for that far amp right there. So I'm just working with what I had. At. So it's about 75 feet of wire, man. And this wire is not cheap. This ain't no baby wire either. Uh, all the sound stuff will be hooked up today i have to i have to source some help from uh mr rick i appreciate you i know he's gonna watch this video but as far as the inside man it's closing in it's closing in i also want to say too if you are in a rush all right or if you are impatient please don't hit me up just please don't hit me up just kill everything just don't hit me because this stuff cannot be rushed right and 
I, I had a nightmare last night and I woke up at three something and I was about to come out here and work. But I was like, nah, it's, it's not about to happen. So I'd be doing the best I could do with times, man. Like if I run into an issue with your car, I, I always, anybody can tell you, I just chunk it up and it just take me a little more time. But if you want me to just work on this thing all day consistently, stop all my quick money, just stop everything. That's something I'll have to charge by the hour because this ain't no this ain't no small work. Like literally the whole car getting ripped apart, diagnosing and repairing wires. Like every piece of fabric on the inside of this car get touched, sanded, scraped, glued, wrapped, heated up, like, come on. Like then you got lights, everything get wired. It's a lot of work that go in this stuff. So if you are impatient, just don't hit me. Don't hit me. Yeah, like it's no way around it. You, you gotta have some patience with this. What's up, y'all? Back. Had to go to Home Depot. I need some uh, dielectric grease and a three by sixteen, three eighths dash sixteen MPT tap. And then uh, once the speaker wire come in today, I'll be able to close the trunk out completely. Then on to closing out the inside. Yeah. I underestimated this one, man. I underquoted it in there, you boy. The fact that I like this stuff so much, it's like easy to find myself doing something for free or cheaper or cheap. Once uh, I get into it, and I hate, I hate that. But it's something that I gotta shake. Cause I always find myself giving away labels for free, giving away parts for free. I gotta stop. But uh go these two things and then I can get back in the truck. I've been out since nine o'clock. It's about seven. It's definitely gonna be about 16, 14, 16 hours today. Okay, got that. Now we gotta get the uh Grease, and we can go back. Yeah, I'll go. I'm gonna stop walking for a second. Seal, rubber hair protect, and insulation, electrical contacts, spark plugs, and battery terminals. So, what that's gonna do is for that ground wire, it's gonna uh, eliminate any rust, water, shoot it. But it's something that you, since it's outside the car, something you gotta check on. Yeah, now could go bad. Good, uh, you need to be re but just gotta take some measures to prevent all that stuff. So, let's check out, go back to the shop. All right, prime the speaker wire. Amazon called me soon as I was leaving Home Depot, so that's a plus. I can do this right now, as long as it's good quality, like uh, the reviews say. Get back in the shop. Okay, okay. That's about it for the day, man. It's 11 o'clock. 14 hours. I gotta get out of here before I hate it. 
But uh, yeah, it's looking like something now. Looking like something. Trunk completely done, man. I'm waiting on some heat shrink. I gotta take the ground on the frame off, heat shrink it, and two grounds that's on the negative on the battery. Show y'all this trunk though. This boy is looking great. Put this fan on. Yeah, the trunk looking great, man. Like, great, great. I just want to say, too, <coughs> I'm not giving no quotes without seeing the car. Because this was uh, some work. Definitely was some work. So, yeah, see, I got to heat shrink those, too. Yeah, man. That's the ground on the frame. Dielectric grease on it. Keep it clean. Won't get uh rusty and stuff. But yeah, speaker wires I gotta redo some of those. But I really just want to hear what this thing will sound like. Oh man, yeah. This clip. I recommended a new dash. Didn't want to proceed. This is not something that I could do again, ever again. Like I say, uh, I'm gonna have to see the car, and if it comes to taking panels apart and dropping stuff to see what's under the dash and cutting the dash to see what's under the the material and that's what it comes to because this is just not something that i put out and i didn't gave all i can give on the free side so <sighs> man it's frustrating to say i ain't even lie to y'all like the dash is so tore up that you can't even wrap it the 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 actual top part if you know about these dashes they got like a top layer the top layer which is the color this dash is so messed up that the top layer is coming off with the material when you try to wrap so as soon as you wrap it it just come apart and it's like damn like all this just comes back off material under here shit crazy man that's not something i do that's not something i put out and i'm not cool with it just leaving like that gee that is like ugly as hell and i meant to show you all the time like i came out here at nine o'clock i went in the house to eat and wash up for probably an hour and a half let's see if this phone did or not it's another day this is not what i do this is not how i work